and welcome back to Exotic Gaming, where base builds, death traps, and zombie extermination are at their finest. Today, we are going to look at three more base builds for Alpha 19 that are simple and easy to make without concrete. Subscribe if you want to see more, and let's begin. For base number one here, it's built on top of a broken down bridge. I have put some spikes in the water so that when the zombies fall from the top, they fall into the water into the spikes. I've also dug a little bit under spikes in case they fall deep and get stuck maybe. As we go up here, these are trap doors that lead into hatches that you will stand here. And as you're standing, you will flip these when they get close and hopefully they fall through that. They come on the other side of the bridge. They walk up these stairs, up these railings into spikes optional and they hopefully come this way sometimes they like to go around through the hatchway but that's fine they jump this they get whacked with the robotic sledge and any zombies that get through here hit the gate they get through the gate you have a hatch door here they sometimes they'll jump this and then you can use either the floating method that we talked about in episode one to just glitch them out right here or you can climb these ladders shoot them at the gate and if all else fails, you have the mini bike to go fuck it and drive away on. Coming up on base two here, this is a little bit different. Got staircases going up a mountain, turning back around and using another floating method hack type thing to make them jump over. If they make this jump, you have powered hatches here that you would control via switch in here. If you turn, make sure you turn the generator on, that could be bad. And then you have hatch doors here that you use that if they get through this system, they get stuck here for melee combat, which you will do inside here. They can't jump them because of these stone blocks. Now, if this becomes an issue, you can jump on these ladders from the side and then the zombies will be whacking at these. And then if shit really hits the fan, they'll start climbing up here. And then they'll try to use the floating method again on top of itself. So we have floating method here, floating method here, double float. And they will uh, be stuck here, falling down and coming back up over and over and over. Like the bases so far? Smash that like button and subscribe. I do all kinds of 7 Days to Die content daily. Base number three here is one big block of cobblestone. Here's how it works. You come through the doors and these hatches go underground. If you go underground, I got to turn on fly mode. If you go underground here, you can see up through the floor, the zombies that are attacking the doors above you and you can shoot from under them. I don't see many uh, horde bases that function like this. So I thought this was a neat little idea. And if they manage to break through that, they're going to come through these hatches, come down, and then you have more hatches to go down with. And you have a second level. Make sure you close these. You have a second level to shoot back up through more bars at them attacking hatches. And zombies don't really attack bottom floor objects more than one at a time very often. So this will last for quite a while. But even if they do break through this, you have... You dig a little hole into the floor here and we're so far down that if they come through here they probably won't dig i haven't seen them dig in the two trial runs i've done of this yeah the stairs right here lead up to the hatches so you can come up hit and back down and they can't reach you it's very hard for zombies to hit you while you're backing down um, on an angle here but it is worth noting that if they break through this, you're kind of fucked. There's, there's nowhere to go. I guess you could break, bring a, make an escape hatch here. But then they're going to want to path to that escape hatch and come down that way. And it just creates more of a headache that you have to defend. So might as well throw all your chips in the one, one method here. Check out my other horde base videos in the playlist below. And click the bell while you subscribe to be notified for more of these bases. Thanks for watching and I'm deucing out. Deuces.